hey guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome my name is victoria and this is time and tenderness well guys welcome back today i'm going to be bringing you my top 10 current favorite pregnancy items so i am settling well into my second trimester and I am already starting to collect an assortment of various different pregnancy items and I have my top 10 that I can't I go every day I use them every single day I can't go a day without them was what I was trying to say so let's jump into it and start off with me listing off the top 10 and explaining everything this video also goes in conjunction with a blog post over on my blog so if you want the links to all of these items as well as more of a description about them that'll all be over on my blog which will be linked in the description down below so let's get started okay so the first item that I am quickly discovering that I cannot live without is a pregnancy pillow and this one is massive I think that's as much as I will bring into frame but it is the Pharmadoc uh, pregnancy pillow that'll be on my website linked um, on my website but I recently started having some hip pain and then as I was sleeping on my side my stomach isn't that big yet I'll show you some days he likes to poke out more than others but um, when I lay on my side sometimes I can feel it kind of hanging so I decided to just go ahead and bite the bullet now and get a pregnancy pillow this one was highly rated on Amazon what drew me to it is that its cover is removable and part of the pillow is detachable so if I wanted to make it smaller I can and I can also wash the cover as much as I need to so that is my number one pick for today for my pregnancy related items is this pregnancy pillow my number two favorite item that I started using I started using this right after I found out I was pregnant because I'm really passionate about skincare and keeping my skin in its best condition and it is the Mustela Maternity Stretch Mark Cream. What drew me to this line in particular and to this cream in particular is that it is 97% all natural. There's no fragrance, no harsh chemicals, which is what I try to tend to gravitate towards. I don't stick hard and fast to a clean only skincare routine or clean only products, but I try to reach for them when I can so this was the first thing I got um, it is a little bit pricey I think it's uh, 18 to 20 dollars on Amazon and I only use it on my torso area and hips the rest of my body I use a regular body lotion but this I love it so much it keeps my skin really hydrated I haven't noticed any stretch marks yet and no itching or anything so this keeps my skin hydrated all day my third must-have pregnancy item is good old-fashioned bio oil so this is trusted by so many people to help prevent stretch marks as well as to reduce the appearance of stretch marks my friend um, Brie Rook over on her channel she raves about bio oil all the time so I finally took the plunge and bought it so after I moisturize with my body lotion with the Mustelle lotion I lock everything in with this bio oil I normally don't like oils too much because I find that I feel sticky afterwards and just hair sticks to me, my clothes stick to me, but the bio oil formulation doesn't leave you sticky or feeling greasy. It just absorbs beautifully into your skin and it keeps your skin glowing all day long. My fourth favorite pregnancy item is the Mary Ruth's Organics Prenatal liquid multivitamin. I am not sponsored by Mary Ruth. I know some people are. I wish I was because I strongly stick by this product. Um, if you know me or if you listened to my pregnancy announcement video, I had very severe morning sickness. I was not formally diagnosed with hyperemesis, but I am on all the same medications that somebody who has, who typically has hyperemesis is on. Um, as soon as I started the, these prenatal vitamins, I noticed a significant decrease in my nausea. I was taking good old fashioned prenatal pills before, but we decided to maybe change up my prenatal vitamin based on the needs of my pregnancy at the time. Because as you go through pregnancy, your body needs different things during your different 
you know, growing periods during different trimesters. So for the first trimester of pregnancy, I was taking something that was very high in folic acid because that's what the baby needs at the time. So now that I am in my second trimester, we switched over to these Mary Ruths and I absolutely love them. My energy is through the roof. My nausea was diminished within 48 hours of starting to take these prenatals and I have not only the prenatal but I have the liquid iron as well as the omega that I take every day and I take it with a glass of orange juice it doesn't taste the best but it definitely is worth it so kind of going along with the theme of my nausea and how I help my nausea in addition to the medication that I'm on as well as the prenatal um, multivitamins is that I need to eat regularly and sometimes I'll be out and about driving and I get hungry and I can't exactly stop what I'm doing and get a meal so what I carry with me are these mama bars if you can see it these are protein bars they are fortified with 12 grams of protein iron folate and choline which are all essential for pregnancy and for a developing baby so I saw an advertisement I was influenced on social media with these and I ordered them I ordered the small box first and I ate them all within a week it really helps keep me full longer I'll have a bar of this before bed because when I'm sleeping I'm going a long stretch without eating so I'll have one of these bars with a glass of milk before bed and it keeps me sustained through the night now number six is not something that i have a hard favorite for yet i'm still looking for the perfect one um but it is seltzer water specifically this one currently is my favorite it's from trader joe's it's the lemon if it'll focus it's the lemon elderflower soda so this is a kind of a soda it's not a seltzer but in the summertime, so last summer, the summer before, I really enjoyed drinking the spiked seltzers, so White Claws, Trulies, High Noons, those kinds of things. I really enjoyed drinking those on a hot summer day when we're eating crabs at my in-laws or when we're grilling out. I really enjoyed drinking those, or when my husband is enjoying a beer, I would have one. Because I'm pregnant now, I can't drink alcohol, uh, so I am looking for a better seltzer alternative. And seltzer water has been on the market for decades, yet for some reason, the flavors just, they just aren't the same. So you have the spike seltzers and their flavors are absolutely amazing, but then you just have regular seltzer water. It's like, why? Why? I know it's probably commercialism and capitalism and all that, but... I'm still looking for the perfect seltzer, but currently these seltzers from Trader Joe's, or this is actually soda, duh, um, they're my current favorites. Jumping back into skincare for number seven is the vitamin C suspension from The Ordinary. I don't know if that'll focus or not, but I was starting to get some dark spots on my skin, especially on my cheeks. Um, some people refer to this as pregnancy mask. It can happen to some uh, women during pregnancy just from the hormone changes. I was getting some dark spots on my chest as well. So I wanted to try a new vitamin C um, cream or serum. I was using a different vitamin C serum before and I just didn't really notice a difference. I noticed, I, I do know that vitamin C can be very fickle when it comes to skincare because it can get it can deteriorate and lose its effectiveness very quickly so i got this vitamin c suspension from the ordinary it's one of the top rated products that they have and i noticed a huge difference within 48 hours of using this day and night i noticed i noticed a significant difference and now there are certain days that i just go without makeup because i feel that my skin is clear enough that the tone is even enough and it all has to do with this product so number eight is my favorite water bottle from Bottled Joy. I'm sure we're all convinced that if we find the perfect water bottle, we will suddenly become water addicts. And that's how I felt. I have so many water bottles that I've tried over the years, but this is the only one that I consistently keep glued to me that I find that I drink the most when I have this near me. And if you are pregnant, you should be drinking extra water because that helps your amniotic fluid levels as well as just your overall hydration levels because you can get very dehydrated when you are pregnant. So I got this water bottle well before I even was pregnant, but now I am really, really appreciating it because it is keeping me hydrated, especially this week has been so hot and I have just been going through water like crazy. So this is my favorite water bottle of all time. Now, number nine is going to be an interesting one. We have these baby bump headphones. 
So they have these little sticky pads on them and I stick them to my stomach and we play some of our favorite music to the baby because he is now old enough in my belly to hear and recognize voices and his uh, memory is starting. Um, not that everybody remembers anything when they're in the womb, but there are some studies that show that some infants when they're born, they can recognize certain sounds, certain songs, as well as certain voices. So he'll be able to hear my voice and understand that it's me when he's born, as well as my husband when he's born. And we wanted to make sure that there were certain songs that he recognized, songs that are special to us that we wanted to play to him at a very early age. So that is why we got those headphones. Now, last but not least for my favorite products that have been getting me through pregnancy so far is the HelloFresh meal delivery service. Now, again, I'm not sponsored by them. I'm not sponsored by anybody in this video, although I wish I was because I love all of these products so much, but HelloFresh has really gotten us through. Like I mentioned before, I was so, so, so nauseous. I couldn't even go into the kitchen. I was so grateful that my husband was working from home because I couldn't feed myself. He had to do everything. He had to get me breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And he still is bringing me breakfast every single day in bed because when I first wake up, I'm a little nauseous. So he goes and gets me some oatmeal. But when I was so nauseous that I couldn't step foot in the kitchen, the HelloFresh really helped because HelloFresh makes it so easy with their detailed instructions. Everything is pre-measured and pre-portioned that my husband was able to throw down in the kitchen and make amazing meals with HelloFresh's help. So if it wasn't for HelloFresh, I have no idea what we would have done. Well friends, I hope you enjoyed this video. It is a bit different than what I've ever posted before and now that I'm pregnant. I'm trying to bring a little bit of pregnancy content here to my channel, but like I mentioned in my pregnancy announcement video, I don't fully intend to become a mommy channel or a pregnancy channel or a, like, a channel like that. I'm trying to stay true to myself, stay true to what I have continuously been posting, but also bring in some new topics that I know you guys will enjoy. So if you enjoyed this video, if you want to give me some feedback on this video, please don't forget to hit like, subscribe, leave me a comment down below. If you're new here, welcome. I would love to see more of you. I try to respond to as many comments as I can. So please leave me comments below as well as find me on Instagram. I love to interact with you guys over on Instagram. So I will see you guys next week. I hope you guys have a wonderful week and please stay safe and bye.